welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Carolina. Thank you so much for watching. Today's video, I am going to be showing you how to achieve this very simple, easy 10 minute makeup look. This is something that I do when I am running late for work or I want to put on foundation, but I don't have a whole lot of time to do it. I just do something simple and easy like this and I am out the door. So that's what today's video is going to be about. If you guys want to see how I achieve this 10 minute work makeup look, just keep watching. Right, so let's just go ahead and get started. So I want to show you guys just like a simple, easy look to do. No falsies, no eyeshadow, nothing like that. Just basically focusing on the skin. This is very similar to something that I did when I tried out the L'Oreal foundation, which is the foundation that I'm going to be using today because I have been absolutely loving this foundation. This is the only one that I've been wearing nonstop ever since I tried it out for my first impression wear test video. I have been loving this foundation. This is like the only one that I've been using. So the first thing I do is like prime my face. So I'm going to be using the Smashbox Primer Water. This is one of my favorite sprays. So this is just like a primer water spray. You can put it on before your makeup, during your makeup, after your makeup. So I always use it before my makeup. So I'm just going to go ahead and spray some of this. I love using this, especially in the morning. Kind of like wakes me up a little bit. I am going to be using two primers. I normally use a mattifying primer and then a different primer for the rest of my skin. I am going to be using the Soap & Glory uh, One Heck of a Blot Primer. This is like a pore perfecting and a mattifying primer in one. So I am going to be using this on my T-zone. The rest of my face, I'm just going to be using the e.l.f. Putty Primer. I do really like it. I do like both of these together. Um, and I do like it as well with the foundation. I do have like acne on my face right now. So what I like to do, because I don't have a whole lot of time during the day to sit there and like add another layer of foundation or go back with concealer or anything like that. I love using my NARS concealer in a pot. This one is in light 2.75 Canal. I'll just take my beauty sponge. This is the e.l.f. beauty sponge. And then I'll go over those areas where I see any kind of redness or any breakouts or anything like that before I apply my foundation just so I won't have to go in with another layer of foundation. So anywhere that I see any kind of like breakouts, I just tap this in with the Beauty Blender. Already looks so much better with just the concealer. So now I am going to apply my foundation. And I am going to be using the L'Oreal Fresh Wear Foundation. This one is in the shade 460. I'm going to go ahead and pump some on the beauty sponge. I do have two pumps and then if anything, I can go back with another one. But usually two pumps is enough, especially if I add the concealer to those areas where I have blemishes. So all I'm doing is just tapping this in. The only thing I don't like about this foundation is that once you first get the product out, it does smell like alcohol, but I don't smell it after I blend everything out. Like the smell doesn't linger. So just FYI, if you are sensitive to smells, I do powder my face for sure. Um, and then right now I'm just using this Tarte, um, powder. I just use the same beauty sponge and then I'll take some on this side and I just go over my chin area. What the areas where I get the most oily. Just like that. And then if I need to add grab some more I will put it on my forehead because I get really oily here. And then I'll take this big fluffy Real Techniques brush and then whatever is on the top, I'll just tap it on the rest of my skin. I do bronze up my face a little bit. I go in with my uh, Too Faced Chocolate Soleil bronzer. Fluffy. 
For blush, I am just using this Pretty Vulgar blush. I do add a little bit of highlight. I'm just going to take my Fenty highlighter. For eyebrows, I usually just use my Essence Make Me Brow. I love this product right here. But I'm basically out of it, so I'm just going to go in with my ColourPop Brow Pomade. And I'm just going to take the smallest amount. And I'm just going to basically just bring color back to my eyebrows because we did put the powder and foundation over it. And... I'm not really going to do much to them. I'm just going to like follow my natural brow shade. Like I said, I'm not doing um, eyeshadow or anything like that. So I just add on mascara for liner. I just use a nude eyeliner. This one is by Ruffalon. This is the Exaggerate Waterproof Eye Definer Eyeliner. So now for lips, I just usually do a gloss. So I'm just going to line my lips really quickly. I've been loving this L'Oreal Liquid Lipstick, so I'm going to go ahead and use that. I wanted to share my little 10 minute work makeup routine with you guys. So again, I don't do this every day just because I want to give my skin a break and I don't like using foundation like every single day. Um, but on the days that I do want to put on foundation, this is basically all I do. You can even do this if you're going to school still. Something just very quick and simple and easy to do that's not going to take you forever. Especially if you're running late. I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye.